Here's a Apple iPad Air fourth generation. I'm going to show you two ways how you can take a screenshot. Okay, so the first way is pressing two buttons, the power button and the volume up. If you just press both buttons at the same time and just let go, volume up, power, ready? Now take note that all of your screenshots gets, will get saved automatically into your photos gallery down here. So if I tap on that right there, if you go to the library, you can see all your photos that you've taken, screenshots, uh, videos under library. If, if you want, you can go more specifically. If you look down here, it says screenshots. So tap on that. You can see all your screenshots here. Now the second way to take a screenshot is um, is by enabling assistive touch. So just go to your settings here, and then from settings, go ahead and scroll down until you see accessibility. Tap on accessibility right here, and now. Now from here, tap on touch, and then assist the touch on, on top here. Let's go ahead and tap on that. Now make sure you turn this on right here, assist the touch, turn that on. It's going to be a little floaty icon here, okay? Now we can do several things. We can make single tap, we can tap it once to take a screenshot, or we can do double tap, tap this little floaty thing twice to do a screenshot, okay? So for example, I already have double tap on screenshot. You can also do long press. You can press and hold it, okay? So a uh, single tap right now is on open menu here. Let me tap on that and I'll find screenshot, which is right here. So I'll tap on that right there. And now I can tap that once, but I also have it set on double tap. And of course you can go ahead and set it on long press as well. And you can kind of like move this around, it always stays on there. And this is great if one of your um, buttons are broken or you, you don't want to use uh, two fingers, you can just go ahead and use the um, assistive touch. So pretty simple. Good luck.